Welcome to the application delivery how-to video series. My name is Aram. Today we are going to cover the topic of how to configure HTTP to HTTPS redirect on AVI. Let's jump into it and look at our configured HTTP virtual service. So it listens on port 80 and let's issue a curl request to see how it replies. With simple curl command, we could see the reply is 200. So now let's go and actually configure the redirect. It's as simple as editing the HTTP application profile, going to security tab and enabling HTTP to HTTPS redirect checkbox. Don't forget to add a port, 443 SSL, select the SSL profile and select appropriate certificate. And let's save. And again, let's issue a call request. So now we could see it's being redirected to HTTPS. All right, uh, there are a few other options how we could do that. Let's take a look. First, let's disable the application profile checkbox. And the second way to do it is through policies. So if we go to HTTP request policy, create a new one, and then we'll match everything. And then the action would be just redirect to port 443. That's it. The redirect will work as well. And the third option is to use data scripts. So let's remove the policy and go to the data scripts and I'll add already existing data scripts. Let's just look inside. And it's on the HTTP event request. So basically it will issue a function of HTTP redirect to existing hostname, existing URI with HTTPS if port is not full through. So there are three ways to do HTTP to HTTPS redirect. First is enabling checkbox inside the uh, HTTP policy in the application profile, security, HTTP to HTTPS redirect. Second one is to go to HTTP request and create a policy just to do a redirect. And the third one is to go and create a data script that will use HTTP redirect function to do so. Thanks for watching. Please check out other exciting videos in our application delivery how-to series.